At Twin Cities Orthopedics, we believe less pain is your gain. So we stay in the fight with you. This is your victory, and you've earned it. Welcome to this Timberwolves Fast Break presented by Twin Cities Orthopedics. I'm Marnie Gellner with Rebecca Brunson. The Timberwolves beat the Jazz in Salt Lake City tonight by 10, 118, 108 behind a big fourth quarter from D'Angelo Russell. Huge. He came on and he was so efficient in the fourth quarter. Look, he did not miss a shot. It's like as soon as he felt like he can create some offense for himself, he did that. He's a guy, he said, look, I don't think the game, I play the game. And right now he's playing so freely. He's able to get to the basket when he needs to. And then when Utah decided that they want to sit back into a zone, he moved throughout the process of the zone, picked his shots, sprint, ran around, got to openings, got in gaps, and was able to just knock it down. So big fourth quarter for D'Lo. Coming off a 14-point fourth quarter last game, now he has 20 in the fourth this game. And just put in work, made sure that he did everything to make sure that they were going to get this win tonight. Russell went 6 of 6 from 3 in that fourth quarter. The Timberwolves shot 53% for the game. But the story of the night was D'Angelo Russell and his late heroics once again. He's really locked in on his shot right now. It looks clean and um, he's, he's letting it go. Um, you know, I thought we did a really good job, Kyle in particular, of finding him in that against that zone. Um, you know, playing with a lot of confidence right now. It's really good to see. The Timberwolves will play again tomorrow night. They're off to Portland to face Damian Lillard and the Trailblazers. We have an 8.30 pregame show. Tip off just after 9 o'clock in Portland. Thanks for watching this Timberwolves Fast Break presented by Twin Cities Orthopedics.